The following is a commercial presentation brought to you by Collectibles Guru. Hi, I'm Gary Ashburn, and I've been working in the world of collectibles and memorabilia for over 30 years. Here at the Collectibles Guru, we only bring you genuine and exclusive memorabilia from the worlds of sport, music, TV and film, heritage, and even more. Every item we bring you will come with a certificate of authenticity. It'll have our name, our address, our phone number. In other words, you can always contact us. And most important, we're a member of Aftel, who are one of the top three autograph trade associations in the world. This means that every collectible item we bring you is guaranteed 100% genuine. So when we say an item is signed, we guarantee it is hand signed and not a printed or a facsimile signature. So if you're looking for a unique, unusual and highly collectible gift for yourself or for someone you love, then this is the place to be. Hello and a very warm welcome once again. Thanks for joining us uh, for the Collectibles Guru here on Sporty Stuff TV. Um, I am delighted to say uh, that once again me, Ben Mosby, is joined by the Collectibles Guru himself, Mr Gazza, Gary Ashburn. How are you doing mate? I'm alright mate, how are good you? Good to see you. Yeah, love the jacket. Thank yeah. you, love we the waistcoat. If they did it in my size actually, it'd be good wouldn't it? But never. <laughs> we've, all, uh, we've all dressed up prim and proper ready for the yeah. occasion. And like, something a bit diff uh, different this time isn't it? Yeah, I mean, obviously on sporty stuff, you probably wouldn't expect to see uh, music items, but we thought it'd be nice to give you a little look at some of the other hot collectibles in other areas. Yeah. This is just a tiptoe through the beginning. And if you really like these, we'll bring you more. But we have, you know, music, we have TV film, we have heritage. But this one, all about the world of music. Absolutely. And as with the other shows, by the way, if it's the first time that you've uh, seen us here on Sporty Stuff TV, a very warm welcome. If you have seen the other shows, again, it's going to be uh, exactly the same nice and easy to order if you see something that you like uh, you can use the free phone number which is 0800 254 5402 or of course you can order online and spread the cost of your purchase over four interest free payments the website is collectiblesguru.com it's always worth a look on there as well because like uh, guys is saying there's all sorts on there you know obviously we're going to be concentrating on um, music today uh, but sport and loads more on there as well Gaza. yeah loads as I say whatever you're into whatever your genre is there's pretty like this is going to be something you enjoy I mean the TV film world there's Star Wars Star Trek you know Game of Thrones obviously James Bond big section but there's a good old mix on there whatever you're into ancient or current there's a good mix whether it be music or sport or, or, or again TV film yeah. have a little look That's keep it. checking regularly because it constantly changes Yeah, and have a good look around the website as well find out more about Gaza so, such an interesting bloke who's been regaling me with stories uh, before <laughs> this show about all the, uh, the famous folk he's He's I, met. I met a few. Yeah, you met a few as well. Oh, well, yeah. But, yeah, but uh, yeah, I've always, actually, to be honest, I mean, the ones I've been lucky enough to meet are usually very, very friendly. You know? Yeah. It's usually the ones who aren't so big, I find, or uh, carry a bigger uh, a bigger pot of uh, steel <laughs> around with them, you know. <laughs> the bigger they are, the nicer they seem to be, you know. But that's anyway, it. that's the story. Bit of controversy. Well, yeah, <laughs> always. Uh, shall we delve into uh, what's going to be coming up over the course of the show, Gary? Yeah, let's go. Yeah, now what we've got here is a whole selection of limited edition discs. They're all numbered one to a hundred, so the one you get will be the only one in the world. These are bigger than the normal discs that you would find. They come complete with a, a 10 by 8 photograph of the star, and again, you've, uh, they're about 50 by 60 centimeters, so much bigger than the normal ones. And these are exclusive, you won't find them anywhere else. They're a special TV promotion, we managed to get some of the stock. This one's Elvis Presley with his famous NBC TV uh, gig, then there's Queen Greatest Hits, they don't come any bigger than that. Yeah. These are exact replicas of what you'd see, but we've made bigger versions to make them different. And of course, once the 100 are all sold out, that's the end of them, you won't see them again. Uh, really special. This, of course, is Oasis. What's the story? The album there. This is a frame platinum version. You've got the photographs there and you've actually got the song sheet as well. So it's a really different, great sort of item. These have proven really, really, really popular. Then we show you something a little different. This takes you back to Debbie Harry, of course, Blondie. You know, that's my era. Uh, you've actually got um, these will come framed. It's like a, a, a mounted CD, uh, the original CD, signed by Debbie Harry with the uh, CD itself. 
great one. Then you've got Paul Weller. Wow, he's massively popular. Yeah. As they call him, the Mod Father, of the course. The Mod Father, yes. Yeah. And again, great image of him there and his genuine hand-signed signature. All of these items here, those ones are all hand-signed. Then we have the Beatles. This, of course, the infamous Abbey Road album. We have other Beatles ones on the site as well, so do check that out. Once again, limited edition of only 100 worldwide. So the one you get is the only one that exists. Then this is hot off the presses. Mm. We thought it would be nice to offer this with a lot of uh, interest, of course, because of uh, recently sad events we live in Newton John. But there you've got the Grease album, the platinum version, new disc, new recording. I'm sure this will fly again, limited edition of 100. Then we have something different Led Zeppelin, Mothership. Again, always popular frame platinum disc, like all of them, same size, 50 by 60 centimeters, bigger than normal. We'll give you that in inches if we can. And then we've got the Stones. You've got to have the Stones, haven't you? This is a great image. This is the Black and Blue album. And again, you've got the Platinum Disc, the CD version from there, and a great colour photograph of the band. And to say, whatever one you get, it's at random the number, but you'll be the only person in the world with that particular number. So once you get it, no one else will ever get that number. So it really, it's like having your own limited edition of one. But they have proven massively popular. Yeah. A lot of bars and clubs have bought them, or I know lots of people who've bought a lot of them. And up there, one lady I know has built, a, up, uh, she got up the stairs oh, in her house. Amazing. She's done a collection of up. them. And then into a sort of office, as she calls it, you know, and they look fabulous. They look amazing. These always come with a health warning though, because once you've bought one, you will definitely, definitely want more. They are fab, they really are. Yeah, they do look the absolute business. And of course, what we've just shown you there is just a bit of a sneak peek as to what's coming up in the first half of the show. There's lots more to come over the course of the hour as well. And the great thing, of course, if you shop at the website, collectiblesguru.com, you can spread the cost of your purchase as well. Um, but let's start off with uh, David Bowie. This is uh, item number 390488. Uh, it's the Aladdin Sane frame gold disc and uh, photo display. Again, uh, limited edition. Yeah. As soon as these went out, um, they, they were originally produced for another TV channel as a limited edition. So you can't get them anywhere else in this format. There's other similar versions that say these are bigger. And what makes them different? They come complete with a, a 10 by 8 image, generally, of the star. And you've got the CD case that relates to that album. Yeah. That's the same. Apart from the, being the size, that's the same format as the originals are now. I mean, obviously, if you were lucky enough to have the originals, one of them, maybe, we make about 10 normally but if you were lucky enough to have an original disc of Aladdin Sane goodness knows what we were worth I'll guess 50,000 100,000 wow pounds. serious massive money massive money yeah. so what these are is an opportunity it's like buying a piece of art you can get the original is one price the signed print is another price and then you get a print that's what you're getting you're getting something that looks exactly the same it looks di these are actually slightly different because we've made them bigger but generally looks the same put them on the wall there's the same it's numbered so as you can see whichever one you get uh, it comes okay. with a certificate mm. you know which will tell you what number you've got and uh, they are you do get the certificate as I say so you'll know exactly what number you've got and you'll be the only person in that in the world with that and once the hundred are gone that is it they don't do any more sometimes they come out in platinum because they're so popular but after that that's the end of them so which you, you know when it, any of these you get, you'll be one of 100 people in the world to own one. Bowie is phenomenal, massive, massive. Anything to do with Bowie flies out. Yeah. It absolutely flies. And he is, he is huge. I mean, you know, I grew up through the Bowie era. I mean, he lived, I lived in a similar area, Brixton, but he... Um, he was amazing, wasn't he? I mean, he touched the heart of people through his sexuality, through his music, through his, I don't know, his dance, his art. He was like an icon of fashion, everything. Constantly reinvented himself. And his music was the same, you know. So any Bowie fan, any of these, whichever person you're into, they would absolutely be delighted to get their hands on these. They look fantastic. Yeah, like you said, an amazing artist and uh, a guy who always sort of constantly reinvented himself, you know, through the 60s, 70s, the 80s as well. And like you say, these just look the absolute business. Uh, for, for any Bowie fan, uh, this would be an amazing uh, item to pick up. Limited edition, of course, uh, 249 99 is the price 
price on that. But as always, you can use that uh, clear pay option. So if you want to spread the cost, uh, you can you can go four ways there in clear pay, just sixty-two pounds fifty. Uh, if you want to do that today, uh, three nine zero four eight eight. And it's like with a lot of the sports shows that we've done, obviously with the sports collectibles. I mean, again, a, a, a brilliant gift for someone perhaps who's, who's difficult to buy for, but who loves their music. I mean, oh yeah, you couldn't you couldn't lose with these, really. No. I mean, we've had lots of people. If you say to me you're a collector, they go no, you know. But they go and they got these discs, and the amount of people when they buy one, they've suddenly bought five or six. I could name them by name. I won't then embarrass them on the <laughs> TV. But there's loads of them. You know, they become like friends because they're constantly doing them, and they do look fabulous on the wall. A lot of, as I say, a lot of businesses have, have actually done stuff with them. You know, because you hang them on the wall, memorably, it always turns heads. But if you know someone who loves a bit of Bowie, that that is the perfect gift. And as we always say, maybe you know, money might. Might be a bit tighter now. Have a little think, club together, maybe one or two of you, yeah. you know, and buy them something they'll always want. Because these they will love. I tell you, they will absolutely love these. They look stunning. They do really look brilliant. Yeah, they do. And I tell you what, over the course of the show, you're going to see some of the biggest names in music. And our uh, next item, uh, I mean, really is phenomenal for anybody uh, who loves Elvis Presley. Uh, the King, of course, uh, this is all about the NBC TV special, 307798. I mean, uh, as I say, the King of Rock and Roll, and very much um, sort of in front of a new audience now, because that uh, new movie came out very recently yeah. as well, didn't it? Elvis is like a lot of the artists of this period actually bow is the same we had it with queen you know um elvis is massive anyway absolutely massive but this actually is very evocative or of interest to elvis fans because a very very famous tv special he was on the nbc tv special mm. and this disc was then released it, it originally as a re you know a record vinyl was released and this of course measures that occasion and honors it so it's a fantastic item the elvis fans adore these it's not unusual. I mean, we've got a few Elvis ones on the on the website, so do have a little look. There'll be a few there, but they look stunning. And the Elvis fans have grabbed these in big handfuls. We don't have a hundred of these or anything like it. In most cases, it's a single numbers, but generally these are in very small numbers. And remember, once the hundred have gone, that is it. You won't see them anymore. Yeah, and like you said, again, you know, for any Elvis fan, uh, th this is just a, a once in a lifetime chance to snap up something. Which they're going to adore, have there on the wall, yeah. uh, wherever it might be. I mean, just a lovely, lovely piece of history, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it is. They look great, you know. And and as I say, if you you know, they you say people are hard to buy for, but these really are absolutely superb, you know. And uh, honestly, whoever you buy one of these for, you know, I don't think we've had four returns in about ten years, you yeah. know, because they look stunning. They really do. They're all framed and mounted, ready to just hang on your favourite wall. Take them out the box. They come by courier service, delivered to your door, all in with that, you know, the price there and the delivery does include a courier service within 24 hours I think usually yeah it's the uh, NBC TV special frame gold disc and photo display limited edition don't forget of course as well uh, 50 by 60 centimeters 249.99 is the price on that or 62.50 if you want to pay uh, via clear pay that'll be your first payment of four uh, and you can do all that via the website uh, collectiblesguru.com and very much like Elvis I, I love it now that um, you know m my kids are finding out about some of the uh, you know the, the big artists of the day because they're bringing out the movies that obviously yeah. the movie out and of course with our um, next uh, item that we're going to have a look at of course very recently the uh, Bohemian Rhapsody movie came out yeah. celebrating Queen and what an amazing band they were and still are of course with the new frontman Adam Lambert um, uh, yeah he's done a great job I mean Queen again I, you, in my mind you think oh Oh, they're massive. Oh, he's massive. But uh, most of the people in this show are all huge. We're a massive database, man. But Queen are remarkable. Re it's only recently somebody I know, they. it took me five years. Somebody was looking for a Queen guitar yeah. signed by all the band. We knew it was real because it came from directly from the PR company, had photos and everything of them signing it. But I think it originally were bought for about, it went for about £8,000. Wow. Four months later, they sold it for twenty five grand. You know, that's how rare and that's how passionate people are to get their hands of these sort of artists. This measures, obviously, Queen's greatest hits. It's a wonderful and de 
dare I say, a very, very affordable way mm. of getting something of Queen. You can hang on the wall. It will look great with your art or whatever you want to put it. It will turn heads. You'll love it forever. And it's something that possibly is a collectible of tomorrow. I mean, I do a lot of charity auctions. They, these fly in charity auctions. They love them. I usually have to explain it's not the original yeah. <laughs> prices sometimes. You think, wow, they must think it's just, don't make mistake. These are not the originals. They would be hundreds of thousands of pounds most of most of these discs, you know. But uh, Queen are huge. This, if you love Queen and Freddie, there they are together. And of course it brings you to the period of their hit, greatest hits, you know, yeah. can't be better. No, it can't. And still lovely to hear, you know, Queen on all the radio stations across the country now. And like we said, you know, Adam Lambert with them now, of course, bringing Queen to a new audience. But that, of course, with uh, the, the original um, Freddie. And of course, that gone too soon, was he? Another one of these yeah, I know. talents who was gone far too soon. He was soon. amazing. I'll never forget that. I'm old enough to remember when they first came out at oh, yeah. uh, Wembley, you know, in uh, uh, the days of Live Aid. And they came on and there were so many bands. You think, oh, they've captured it. Yeah. But when Queen came out, I don't know how but they sort of no no disrespect to the other just look at a notch again and they just had that audience in the palm of their hands and I think when that's when they arrived maybe for the broader world audience at that time they were massive and Freddie Mercury you know it's like a lot of these stars they seem to have a a volatile life off off stage you know their passion and their desire is to be out there entertaining but they were an amazing band and this is a wonderful like all these a wonderful tribute in honor of all they've achieved you know yeah it's a lovely piece again uh, the greatest hits framed gold disc and photo display limited edition uh, once again uh, and again, £249.99. Perfect gift. Christmas will be here before you know it. If there's a Queen fan, it will be. You're laughing. Yeah. It'll be here before you know it. Know. Uh, if there's a Queen fan in your life, uh, I mean, this is a perfect gift for them. You can pick it up for just £62.50 today on uh, Clearpay. All the details on the website, collectiblesguru.com. And of course, if you do want to use the free phone, you can 0800 254 5402. Um, in just a uh, few moments time uh, we've got coming up uh, a wonderful uh, sign and frame matter CD from Debbie Harry got some Paul Weller on the way uh, got the Beatles coming up I mean you've got like some of the biggest artists of all time on the show yeah Gazza. we've got a good mix in there yeah we do I mean obviously we you know there's others as I say do have a little look at the website you find a mm. whole range of these but uh, they look fantastic and they're all uh, you know amazing collectibles we should maybe mention that if you go to the website you'll find that some are a different price and you may wonder why the idea is they're more, they are the original traditional size, which is 50 by 40 centimetres. They're, uh, they're, the, uh, they're, they're a bit smaller than these, and it is just the disc with the CD, like the traditional way of doing it. They are actually on there, and they are available from other, you can get them in other places, but uh, again, there's only 50, so they sell out really, really fast. But they're smaller, they're 50 by 40, as opposed to these bigger ones of 100, which are 50 by 60. So that's why it may it face you wondering why they vary a bit. Uh, 392171 for the uh, the Queen frame gold disc of the greatest hits uh, and from Queen to Oasis and I mean oh, I remember when uh, you know Oasis first started up of course it was the big sort of battle of the bands wasn't it in yeah, the 90s you, yeah. were you in the Oasis camp were you in the the Blur camp and of course you know two big um, albums from Oasis um, in the 90s definitely maybe of course and then the one that we've got here what's the story Morning Glory yeah yeah they're huge they've still got a massive following I mean it, it, in some ways I mean you know who knows families but it's sad that yeah. they, you know, they don't perform as a as a duo anymore they both perform in their under their own rights but it, it, as a, an Oasis fan it is I find it a bit sad that they don't perform together but who knows but this is a great way again of rem, you know remembering everything about that if you grew up for that period the other thing about these it's all about nostalgia reminisce you know you actually look at them and you think go I remember that that's that song like it might be the first song, time you've dated your wife or your husband or your boyfriend, the first time you were on holiday. It brings memories back. You know, you have certain songs. Yeah. That's what these are great for, you know. Because you talk to people, you go, oh, yeah, that album was mine when I was at uni or I did this, did that, you know. That's what's so special about them. But they do bring all those passion and memories flooding back. And most importantly, they look fabulous on the wall.
Yeah, and I love with this one as well, you've got the um, the sheet music of Wonderwall there too, yeah. which is just a, a little bit of an extra special touch. Yeah, it's a bit different, this one. Yeah. But the same as the other, the ones we've had, limited edition of 100. There's only 100 in the world. Once the 100 have gone, that is it. I believe we're down to about only 25 of them left mm. in the world, and that's it. Yeah. Once they're gone, you won't see them again, apart from in maybe a, an auction or something. That's it. Uh, it is the Oasis What's the Story frame platinum uh, disc and that photo display limited edition. Yeah, down to uh, you say about the last 25 of those available if you want to get one. £249.99. Uh, again, is, I think it's a great price for something which is just going to be loved, uh, adored, and cherished by any Oasis fan. Uh, item number is 345693. Um, our next item, um, going back in time, I suppose, sort of the 70s, 80s, and this is slightly different because um, it's Debbie Harry, but a uh, personally signed item isn't this it is from Debbie Harry signed yeah Debbie Harry and Blondie again have a massive cult mm. following she was what's commonly known at the time if I dare use it uh, considered a very hot property you know um, many men used to dream they were married or met Debbie <laughs> Harry you know she was uh, a babe and she's still there strutting the stuff now you yeah. know what I mean she's massively popular and what you've actually got here is I mean Blondie were a very successful band what you've actually got here this is a, a, this is a 12 by 10 10 actually this but it's it's um you've got the band you've got their original cd and you've got the the cover and the cd and of course the the uh, message of debbie harry but it's personally signed by debbie harry herself and when we say personally signed we guarantee that's hand signed yes it's not printed it's not facsimile it's not an altar pen we guarantee 100 percent that that is a genuine hand signed signature this item will come with a a, a different certificate of all authenticity that actually confirms like Aftel that actually tells you that it is genuinely signed and the certificate will come with it keep the certificate keep the lifetime guarantee that comes with it because that's your proof and provenance that this is a real genuine signature and once again, if you if you are a big fan of Debbie Harry, big fan of Blondie, you need to snap this up uh, pretty quickly because there's not too many of these around, are there, guys? No, there's very few. It's just a handful. We haven't got many of any of these. They're yeah. very, very few. And uh, once they're gone, they're gone. That's yep. it. You know, they're not easy to get any of these. A lot of these collectibles, some people we have them, think we have them stacked up like, you know, <laughs> Hoovers or <laughs> garden furniture. It's not like that. We've normally, you know, our warehouse could be about the size of your large shed, if anything, you know. Because most of these, we only have a lot of the signed stuff. One, twos, threes. That's all you get, you know. So once they're gone, that is it. We try and get other versions and other exciting things for you. But most of the, most of the items are just a very, very small amount. Yeah, the item number for this one, 396924. Uh, again, personally signed uh, by Debbie Harry, framed and mounted with that, uh, that CD. Looks the absolute business, £139.99 for that one. And again, if you want to use ClearPay, that's available for you on the website. So you can split the cost four ways, just £35 will be your first payment. Uh, or if you do want to call, you can. That free phone number again is 0800 254 5402. Uh, next up, um, Paul Weller, who's a guy I can't, again, he, he's, he's been around for so long and I kind of was listening to his music more in the 90s, but of course previous yeah. to that he was he was in quite a few big bands, Yeah, he? he was in Style Council and people like that. Yeah, yeah. he was massive, yeah. Massive following. And he's commonly known uh, as as the mod father. Yeah. You know, I did an, there's a great show he does the rounds called uh, all, all, uh, uh, all, what's it called? It's all about the small face. It's gone out of my head for a minute. But he went to an event there and he was mobbed, you know, because it was all aimed at the mod movement and the small faces, the band, the small... All or Nothing is the name of the oh, show. Right, okay. Brilliant show and loads of awards, loads of great music in it. But... Paul Weller is massively popular, huge following, you know. And uh, again, similar story, you've got the, there he is in action on the stage, you've got the image, you've got the CD case, and that's his genuine hand-signed signature, signed with the uh, silver Sharpie pen, which means it's uh, like all of them, it's a, it's a permanent marker, you know. By the way, people ask sometimes, is it wise to um, actually have these in direct sunlight? The answer is genuinely no. Mm. But if you can, put them in a 
their frame and put them out of direct sunlight or maybe pay a little extra but per and put non-reflecting glass in them maybe pay a bit extra for that but i personally would never put them in direct sunlight if you can help it because well, it's gonna fade well it can do over a time it's more it was worse with biros and you know like uh, years yeah. ago they does these don't fade as bad but they can still fade if the sun's hitting them on a regular basis yeah oh top tips and top items there you go that's what you'd expect from the yeah. uh, collectibles guru uh, but yeah paul weller fans that's the one for you uh, personally signed uh, by the mod father uh, and uh, again a really lovely collectible for uh, 199 pounds 99 that one item number is 363171 uh, split the cost on clear pay via the website if you want to do it that way uh, first payment of 50 pounds um we're coming back to these um, these frame discs and you know talk about one of the the biggest bands of the 60s and 70s probably one of the biggest bands of all times uh, the Beatles and probably one of the most famous albums um, we've got here yeah this is this the Beatles are massive still you know I mean Beatles memorabilia is just huge you know I mean if you look at a set of you know Beatles autographs a set of genuine autographs maybe five years ago you might pick up for five three four grand now you'd be lucky if you got them for 15 grand you know <laughs> and anything to do with the beat was like a tea towel you know all sorts of stuff you know yeah. people said a tea towel uh, you know like um, anything like tissue paper with them on because it's rare yeah and the other thing that's a tip we're collecting if you're into a particular stuff you know uh, you know celebrity or a whatever have a look out for things that nobody else keeps yeah you know and you think oh they aren't worth them but they are because no one keeps them so if you keep them in years to come they become very collectible in their own right something things you never expect an old pencil a book or something you know keep it all because if it's a big band it's always going to be a demand for it you know so there's another little tip but the Beatles are massive one of the things about this album as well I mean people come from all over the world to have their photographs taken the on that crossing yeah. yeah and if you look carefully Paul McCartney has no shoes on in this I don't know if you know the story there's a big conspiracy theory there is wasn't a big there? conspiracy theory I'm not into conspiracies too much no. but who knows conspiracy theory that the real Paul McCartney was no longer with us yeah and a second Paul McCartney came out this is all the time around the Maharishi and all that wasn't it yeah and at the at that period they were experimenting with Maharishi and all that stuff and it was said that this particular Paul McCartney was a new guy and the idea yeah. of that was well he's crossing the road with no shoes on was because he was cleansing and working it was all a bit for me but who knows read the story if it interests you to me it's just the Beatles Abbey Road really popular great disc and whoever gets it is going to adore it it is and certainly if you do that if you delve into that story they uh, go say leave yourself a few days because that rabbit hole opens up a whole uh, <laughs> sort of other conspiracy theories I'm yeah. with you on it really I'm, I'm not sure whether I believe all of that but whatever no. way like you say it's a beautiful uh, piece for any Beatles fan and let's be honest who doesn't love the Beatles uh, it's the Abbey Road framed platinum disc and photo display limited edition again uh, just 249.99 item number is 308143 uh, next up I mean this is again a, a lovely piece but um, almost quite sad really isn't it that um, what's happened recently with yeah it is John? I mean um, you know we put it on because you know there's been lots of requests to get this yeah. album it's it's something that again I grew up through this love the movie you know I mean John Travolta was amazing and Olivia Newton John was always a you know great singer great act but this movie was one I grew up through you know my period so it meant a lot to me I've always had the uh, the disc yeah you know the actual original vinyl and the, the the thing is a lot of the original vinyl now has soared in value oh yeah massive market for it I believe some of the supermarkets are actually dropping doing CDs and are only selling, selling vinyls. vinyls yeah and more and more bands are actually recording their material in vinyl yeah true some are doing it in vinyl only or they do a vinyl only version that you know is really collectible but I don't think you can be it as an old old chap I won't call myself I, go, I even insult myself for that but <laughs> I grew up for the age of vinyl there's nothing better about going to picking up a piece of vinyl admiring the artwork it's a piece of artwork yeah you know that comes with it the smell of the vinyl the touch of it to me it's magical and I'm delighted that the vinyl is now hot again you know and um, it really is a wonderful recognition of this great movie and a great career of those two were both brilliant John Travolta and Olivia 
Newton John. I sent her so many kisses, and all I ever got back was a signed photo with one on. <laughs> 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 and I think that was from John Travolta. Yeah, probably, yeah. <laughs> so I'm only playing. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, she was lovely, you know, beautiful lady. Never met her, but you could just tell she was a, a doll once she. Oh, always, absolutely. Yeah. And again, it's one of those movies, isn't it, that you know, it's always on the TV screens, obviously massive when it first came out, but then what we now, well, uh, 30 probably more years down the line, you know, a new audience are loving it, and of course there's now like a stage musical as well. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it, it's it's amazing. And it, you know, it was just great. I mean, all those movies of that era were great. I mean, I'm so lucky, I suppose, to have grown up through a lot of that. But if you know someone who loves Greece or that music, a great one, again, a terrific one as a gift, you know. Again, you remember, there's only a hundred people in the world going to be lucky enough to own one of them. Yeah. You know? That's how rare it is. You think you're one of a hundred in the whole world you put these on in the far east and places like that they've been gone in seconds you know because they haven't got the opportunity to get it and the old adage you can't buy these in the high street you can't actually buy these particular discs anywhere other than here this is your only place to buy these discs in this format is on sporty stuff tv so it's a great one i'd love that myself if you're watching gorgeous yeah you know, you've got you're telling me i'm hard to buy there's my christmas <laughs> present you know <laughs> <laughs> 323715 is your item number there. Uh, 249.99 again is the price. Uh, 62.50 if you want to go down the clear pay route, uh, which is available on the website collectiblesguru.com. Do spend a bit of time there, have a look around and see all of the other great uh, collectible items on the website. Uh, next up, um, Led Zeppelin. Mothership, tell us about this. Yeah, Led Zeppelin, really popular again, really, really popular band. Um, massive following. And again, anything to do with them is red, red hot, you mm -hmm. know. So this has proven very popular. There aren't too many of these left either, I know. I think there might be a couple of other Led Zeppelin ones on the on the site, so do have a little look at that website. Uh, you know, collectiblesguru.com, have a little look. But this is a great item, grab it while you can, because I'll tell you what, it'd be really popular. 366920 for uh, that one again, limited edition at 249.99. Uh, four clear pays again, uh, 62.50. Uh, can't believe we're halfway through the show already. Um, and the uh, the first or well, the last of the items that we previewed at the top of the show to show you next um, is uh, Mick Jagger and the Rolling Stones, black yeah, and blue. They're amazing. I saw them live at Twickenham. I'm very lucky to see them at, uh, live at Twickenham um, not that long ago, actually. Yeah, because they're still touring. Years ago. Yeah, they're amazing. They? I mean, Mick Jagger can run around more at his age than I, than I could at 21 <laughs> playing rugby, you know. He's amazing, yeah. you know. I mean, great. I mean, they're great. They are... To me, there are oh, for many years they've been the world's top rock band and still are. And sadly, they've recently lost Charlie Watts, yeah. you know, so it's not going to be the same. But while they're still touring, if you get a chance, just go and see them, you know. They are magical. They, the passion, the effort they put in, and the man hours, you know. I would have to sit in the bath for about three months <laughs> each side to be able to do it. And I don't consider them that unfit, <laughs> believe it or not. But, you know, they are amazing. And their music, I mean, where do you begin? You know, they We've all got a favourite Stones number, haven't we? Any Stones fan, again, would adore that. It is a massive, massive item. They look great. They just hang it on the wall, and whoever you buy it for will probably love you for the rest of your life. Yeah, absolutely right. Isn't it, like you say, amazing to think, like, you know, you think of Mick Jagger as an amazing front man, and the energy it must have taken him sort of back in the day when he was younger, yeah. but still doing it now all these years later. It shows you, like, the, the passion that they've got for, for the job that they do. They still want to do it, because they, they wouldn't have to do it, would they? Let's be no, honest. I wish I'd have had the ability. I played rugby till I was nearly 40, but if I'd have been a rock star, maybe they'd be get, kept going till I was about eight. Me too, no, I doubt it. I don't think they got going, that's the word, but never mind. I can imagine you on stage with a mic in your hand. Yeah, 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 yeah. that's why a lot of them left. <laughs> uh, 354209 is the item number if you want to go for the Rolling Stones uh, black and blue frame platinum disc and photo display, limited edition once again. Uh, 249.99 is that price for you. And of course, use Clearpay. If you love it and you, you haven't got 
got them made so you can spread the cost. Pay, say, pay to 62.50 uh, today. Right, uh, first 10 items done, but we've got a uh, well, a stellar second half of the show uh, coming up. What we got, Gazza? Yeah, we've got another great Elvis. All the Elvis fans will know this is a very evocative special album. Elvis at Sun Records is a very important part of his career. That captures that time. Great image of him, 10 by 8 photo with a platinum disc. Limited edition, only 100 again. Snap it up, Elvis fans will go wild for it. Then George Michael, another great talent, sadly no longer with mm. us. This captures the album older. Lovely image, I think, there with the photo and the, you know, with, this, with the uh, metallic side of, uh, sorry, the platinum. It looks marvellous, great one. This is another uh, signed one. This is a framed uh, disc. You've got the single CD there with the genuine signature of Puppy Love himself, Donny Osmond. I think I danced to that on my wedding night. That Did you? Many moons ago. Yeah. <laughs> Well, on your I, own. I try not to, yeah, <laughs> try not to admit it, yeah. yeah I dance with a cake. <laughs> yeah. And then again, a great one here, the specials. Yeah. They were great, weren't they? Yeah, a great band. This is personally signed by three of the band, framed up with the CD and the signatures. Now, this album is huge. Uh, Pink Floyd, Dark Side of the Moon. Again, we have a couple of others if you go to the website of Pink Floyd. Same idea, limited edition of 100, individually numbered. So the one you get is the only one in the world. Wow. Then we have, oh, Adele. Yes. I mean, what can you say, as it's been said about Adele? Hot, hot property. Uh, went to the Brit School in Croydon. I wish I'd met her there. I know people who were there when she was. But it's a framed platinum disc and photo display. Once again, only 100 in the world. Then Bob Marley. I was lucky enough to see him live years ago. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he was on, I think he was in the ball ring in uh, Ibiza, but he was amazing. But there he is, he says it all, legend, he is a legend, he's still a legend, snap it while you can. Then we have Coldplay, uh, a kind of dream, a wonderful, again, example there in platinum. You've got the image from the disc and the photograph. Remember, these are all 50 by 60 centimetres. They're bigger than the, the normal discs that you get, and they're unique to this channel. Then we have uh, Gallagher there, 6 CD. This is framed and mounted already. Uh, 6 CD images, photo CDs, and his genuine signature wow. on there. That is a fabulous item, ready to just hang on your wall. Then, of course, Lady Gaga. She's done brilliant, isn't she? Really come on, lady. She was good in uh, When a Star is Born. Oh, yes. Really Funny impressed Cooper. with her in that. Mm. You know, I remember the original. But she was great, you know. Lady Gaga, showing me age here, isn't <laughs> Yeah. Meow, <laughs> meow, I don't care. And then, of course, David Bowie. Heroes. That's what he is. Single figures. The last few they are. If you want this, don't even hesitate. It's been a massive seller. It's Heroes, again, a brilliant one. With that artwork photograph, is brilliant of that I love it and so does everyone else so don't mislay on that for goodness sake yeah so much good stuff on the show lots of items are going to be flying out the door you can check out more at collectiblesguru.com but we have got plenty to get through over the final 20 minutes or so of the show um, and tell us about this um, this Elvis uh, collectible at, at Sun Records yeah Elvis at Sun Records was uh, a very key part of his career in the early days Sun is is one of the most uh, famous famous um, record labels ever it really is. It's uh, amazing, you know. El Elvis, the you know the picture of uh, of that sun. Sorry, is as you can see the platinum disc there. Amazing item that mm. is. And it, once again, there's only a hundred of these in the world. So once the hundred have gone, that is it. And you think, I mean, millions of fans there are of Elvis. The gold version of this sold out. I think in about six weeks. Wow. It's, it's massive, you know, and it's huge. And these will fly out the door. Lovely image of the man himself. You can just see it. Oh, 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 who was that? I don't know. <laughs> anyway, someone there is an echo. Are you back in the building? No, he's not back no, in the building. No, he's definitely not back in That's the building. Someone with a sore throat. Anyway, but the man himself's a legend, and any Elvis fan would cherish that. What a great gear. And it has a lot of uh, sort of homage about him to that particular thing, being the, at, at Sun Records, because that was a very important part of his career. And as I say, once the 100 are gone, that is it. You won't see them no more. Yeah, not a lot of those left either. So again, get your skates on if you want to pick that um, up. Again, a really, really lovely gift. And I know we keep talking about this, but if there's somebody you know in your life who's difficult to buy for, you know that they love um, Elvis, uh, then this is a, a really, really lovely gift. And like you said, it might be the, the first uh, kind of item that they have. And once you've had one, you'll come back and shop for oh, more. Oh yeah, they, they look fabulous. If you're building yourself like a, uh, a dome or a shrine to 
to to music, whatever it is, a yeah. shed, a, a man cave, a, you know, a, a dome. A, I like that. Yeah, yeah whatever. You yeah. know, sun out. We know where you like. You know, you have what you want. But they look brilliant. You hang them on the wall, and they look fab. They really, really do. You know, look at them in the studio. Yeah. Just a few out. You know, can you imagine on your wall, your favourite wall at home? Or as I say, I know somebody who's got them going up the stairs. They've got a big hallway, and they have them going up the stairs and around the first level of the house. They've obviously got a few bob them people, mm. but they look fabulous and they still love these. And that's the other thing. If you're looking for a special gift for someone, don't know what the hell to buy them. They might have lots of that or they might have none of it. But when you give them one of these, they'll love you forever because it's one of them things you can't buy anywhere else. They'll yeah. love it. They look brilliant. And you yourself, maybe if you are a musician, potentially, and you've got your own little studio, again, think how great something like this is going to be, you know, hung in, uh, in your music studio. There for a bit of inspiration, potentially, but it is a lovely piece. Once again, uh, stress the fact that these are limited edition and Sorry. you can uh, go for 62 50 uh, today if you want to pay uh, for that on Clearpay at the website collectiblesguru.com. Uh, the other number is 346714. Um, next up, I mean, I feel like I've uttered this sentence a few times on this show, but um, another artist uh, now with George Michael who has gone far too soon um, and so just a There's few years so ago many, passed away. There's so many of these great talents that mm. go. It's, it's just amazing, really. I mean, George Michael, yeah, great talent. The people still turn up regularly in Berkshire, don't they, to his home. Yeah. It was his home there to pay homage to him. I mean, I think the thing that's come out since he's sadly no longer with us is the amount of money and effort he gave to charity. You know, I've never met him, but he seemed a massively lovely guy. Mm. I, I mean, no, you know, the... the I know Martin Goldsmith, they did the first tour of Wham, you know, and all that. And he said he was a lovely guy, you know. And him and Andy Rid Andrew Ridgely were like buddies when they grew up. But, I mean, he achieved so much. I mean, obviously, you know, aspects of him, he appeared that he wasn't happy in his life, which is terribly, terribly sad. And it's amazing how many celebrities seem to have a life that's not quite yeah, where not it should be. It for, you know, they seem to have everything, but they don't have it all. But he was a marvellous singer, great, great voice. And again, any George Michael fan would love it. 378156 is the item number there. If you want to uh, go for that one, it's the George Michael older uh, frame platinum die, um, disc rather, uh, and photo display. Uh, uh, limited edition, 6250 is your uh, first clear pay of four there. Um, collect Collectiblesguru.com is the website. Uh, next up, well, I know someone who's very excited for this next item because, uh, well, he, he, was, he was dancing too much. Oh, yeah, Donny Osmond. the cake. Donny Osmond. Yeah, somebody measured, said it measured. It was the first floor where we had the, the wedding reception, you can imagine. Yeah, yeah. And they kept me up dancing to Puppy Love. And no disrespect to the Osmonds. I yeah. was wanting something a bit more. I could move the hips a Yeah, bit more, it's not the know? danciest number in and, the world, uh, is it? No. And uh, it, it, somebody said when I danced to this, it measured four on the Richter <laughs> scale. You know, I could hear it in the bar downstairs. So I was trying to get it done a bit quicker. I did the foxtrot, I think. But anyway, Donny Osman, massive, massive character. And I mean, the Osmonds are huge. Yeah. Again, they have a massive cult following. And this is a great opportunity. We try to bring you different levels of stuff. But again, a great opportunity. You've got this, it will come framed. You've got the great CD image of him with the photograph there, hand signed by Donny Osman. Yeah. You know, someone you know's heart will go a flutter when you give them that on Christmas Day or birthdays or something, you know. Yeah, um, sorry, I still can't quite wipe that image out of my mind of you <laughs> dancing. When you see me dancing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a bit like that. Yeah. Oh dear, oh dear. Uh, focus on this more. There you go. The lovely yeah. Donny Osmond, uh, personally signed there as well. A lovely, lovely gift for any Osmond fan. One hundred and twenty nine ninety nine is the price on that. Uh, and again, clear pay thirty two pound fifty today. Your first clear pay of four. Uh, that number three seven three two four three. If you'd like to pick that one up. Uh, next up, this is. Um, again, a, a, a signed item from the specials. And whenever I think of the specials, again, it's a song that you hear still played on the radio uh, today. Uh, Ghost Town was there probably yeah, the biggest that was hit, the wasn't one it? Yeah, 
this place do, do, in like yeah, a ghost, ghost town. town. <laughs> yes, right. All the shops. <laughs> yeah, we got stuff to... Sorry, we're, uh, you know, taking a bit wild. We had a couple of uh, soft drinks at lunchtime. I'm only kidding. And a piece of cake. And a piece of cake. I've, I've yeah. got an IPA, sorry. <laughs> but yeah, Even more IPA than normal. The, the, yeah, the specials are a, were a great band. It's some great records and very evocative of the period. Mm. Here again, you've got a, a great image of the... Uh, you've got the CD there and a of course the specials and this is hand signed by three of the band i think it's limvel terry and what was the other one i've got his name i've got the other one's name for a minute i've gone too much cake and pot terry limvel and uh, what was the other one i've forgotten his name who signed this Anyway, we'll have a look in a minute. It's gonna I've had a mind block. But there's three of them, they are genuinely, genuinely hand signed by three of the bands. A great thing. Oh yeah, Horace, wasn't it? Yeah. Oris, Oris Panther. Yeah, I should remember Golden. that. I used Terrible. to have a rabbit called Oris. I should have remembered Did that. You? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, after the guy in the specials. <laughs> well, no, the ra rabbit was older than he would have been. Oh, right. You know, <laughs> he'd have been about 80 now, the rabbit. But anyway, never mind. <laughs> but no, no, it's a great one. But the specials, are, again, massive cult following. Yeah. And again, if you want something special or you know someone who loved them or maybe you danced and grooved to that music at that period in your life, there's your opportunity. Hand signed by three of them. Uh, three seven zero two three eight is your item number. Uh, one hundred and sixty nine pounds ninety nine. Forty two pounds fifty today, though. If you want to go on the clear pay way, uh, you'll find all the details you need about that on the website collectiblesguru.com, where you'll find a whole host more items, of course, uh, as well. If you do want to pick any of these items up on the phone, the free phone number oh eight hundred two five four. 5402. Right, uh, let us crack straight on to our next item, which is, well, potentially one of the biggest albums of all time from a huge band in the form of uh, Pink Floyd, Gazza. Yeah, great. I mean, massive. They were massive. Well, they still are massive. I mean, um, it's really hard to get people like Pink Floyd and Zeppelin haven't actually there's not a lot of memorabilia that's obviously available allegedly they had a policy of not over signing all of them wouldn't sign one at peace to keep them more collectible and not you know not so many around but this was one as you say one of the most famous albums anyone through this era who loved Pink Floyd would have their own memories of this or chilling out to or well, chilling's probably not the world but rocking the rocking the table a bit at night to this you know and uh, it will bring all those memories back but led you know uh, led zeppelin and pink floyd great great bands and this was one of the biggest uh, albums ever wasn't it dark side of the moon mm. every track i knew when i was young yeah and again worth bearing in mind and worth mentioning for people who, who have just uh, tuned in potentially so all of these are um limited edition aren't they yeah every one of these uh, large discs you see in this show they're a limited edition of 100 they're numbered individually they come with a certificate of authenticity which will actually uh, again correspond with the number on the on the in the frame of the uh, particular number of the set you've got so if you've got number 11 you'll have number 11 obviously on the uh, certificate of authenticity and you know there's only a hundred ever produced they don't suddenly bring them out again once the hundred have gone that is it no more they're very 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 special very rare and they look fantastic yeah that is uh, pink floyd dark side of the moon the uh, platinum disc and photo display limited edition of course again as we just heard uh, 249 pounds 99 uh, and available for you on clear pay two uh next up um again you know uh, hot property this uh, lady oh, she must have been around for what 10 12 years now um some, some massive massive hits we're talking about adele she's huge isn't she she's absolutely massive mm. i mean she's and she's lost so much weight you know she obviously went on a different diet to me but, you know <laughs> she looks i mean i with adele who'd care how big she is no, she's got an amazing voice, voice amazing. you know absolutely amazing i mean i love her i think she's brilliant she always comes across as she was, you know, it's a bit of a, I like her voice because she comes from down south like yeah. herself, you know what I mean? She's a lovely, you know, a lovely lady or appears to be very chill, very laid back. But the music she produces is quite phenomenal. But if you love a bit of Adele or you know someone who is, again, fantastic gift. Uh, Adele 30 386 is your item number. Uh, again, £249.99 and available for you on Clearpay. Uh, 
next um, again you know a guy whose music uh, certainly uh, lived on long uh, after his um, his sad and again really early death uh, Bob Marley but a guy who kind of brought reggae music to, to the masses really didn't he? Yeah he did I was brought up in Brixton so reggae was all around me at the time mm. you know I lived in a, a very ethnic area I had loads of mates of all different uh, nationalities but Reggae was all around us, and the Ram Jam Club in Brixton with Gino Washington and all that, if you're that old. <laughs> and uh, Bob Marley suddenly appeared in reggae, but he sort of gave it a gloss. Yeah. He sort of became a, a, a slightly more broadened commercial version of reggae. But he was amazing, and I had the honour to see him live, and he was just fantastic, you know. He was amazing. He's a great talent, obviously passed away far too young, and he's actually one of the most sought-after music artists in the world of anybody there's people do anything to get anything of Bob Marley I mean his autograph on a piece of if you had his on a piece of tissue yeah it, and it's a genuine autograph it'd probably be worth seven to ten grand wow that's serious? how rare it is just his autograph wow so this is an opportunity if you love Bob Marley you know someone he was a legend and you know uh, you, it, it's it's a great way to actually find something that associates with Bob Marley because there's so so little that does you yeah. know, he was an incredible talent, and uh, just looking at that, I think, wow, again. I've, I've got quite a few of these on my own walls at home, you know. The other thing I should say is a little tip, actually. Oh, here we go. If you've got a dodgy wall at home, I hope my estate agent isn't watching, but I didn't tell you this, keep it a secret. But if you've got, say, a, a hole, on, not a hole, but a gap <laughs> on the wall or a <laughs> little crack or something, hang these discs. Oh, yeah. Because every time people came around to see my house, they went, oh, they're flat, oh, they're beautiful. I hadn't painted it for about five years. All they noticed was the discs, and they go, oh, do you work in the music industry? Oh, yeah. Yeah, to a bit, like, you know, <laughs> and they look. Like, oh wow they, that's what they did so there's another little tip there I mean <laughs> seriously all the tips that you need really yeah. uh, home decor advice as well there you go uh, yeah. And, yeah. <laughs> it's a Bob Marley uh, legend Rain gold disc uh, and that photo display again limited edition uh, the item number is 348949 uh, next up uh, a band who I absolutely love and I, I told you this before the show uh, a bit of a claim to fame I actually went to school with Chris Martin yeah. Yeah, from well, Coldplay. I was in the same class as his brother, and he was a couple of years uh, years above me. And I, I, I can say I actually played in a band with Chris Martin. Wow! Uh, yeah, because, <laughs> because <laughs> he was in the orchestra with me, the school orchestra. I played the violin. I think he played the trumpet. Uh, but sadly, you know, uh, he, he left, and that was the last I saw of him. And he went and formed some band which we've done all right called Coldplay. Yeah, yeah that done bad. Done all, they? Not too yeah. bad. Yeah, no, I know. So uh, yeah, but I mean, Coldplay again, a massive aren't they yeah huge One of the people i know recently the world, they? said they're brilliant in concert mm. this again if you love coldplay maybe you went to the concert that's another thing maybe if one of these bands like coldplay have been doing some gigs if you actually went to one of their concerts what a great reminder of that evening out when you think what you paid for the tickets and the popcorn and the drinks and the food and everything what me all you've got is memories which are important but with this you can have something to hang on the wall and you'll never forget it absolutely right three four six seven one zero for the Coldplay Kind of Dreams frame, um, £62.50 is your price today. If you want to split it four ways on ClearPay, um, all the details at collectiblesguru.com. This next item, um, well, again, an absolute cracker. If you want to get it, you're going to have to go swiftly, but um, it's a beautiful um, six CD Liam Gallagher frame piece, but also um, personally signed, isn't it? Yeah, great item, this, um, as you say, framed and mounted, ready to just hang on your wall. You've got six photo CDs of him, as you can see there, with all the images on and then in the middle the barge photograph personally signed uh, himself there by uh, Mr Gallagher so can't go wrong with that it is and again we literally only have a, a few of these single figures once they're gone I'm sure they'll fly very hard to get much signed by uh, Oasis so again grab that quick yeah, absolutely. 340169 uh, is your item number if you want to grab that. Again, if you want to split the cost, uh, 27999, you can go clear pay, uh, 70 pounds. I just kind of wish that, um, that, you know, that you said earlier on, the two would get back together, really. Well, they're so talented, aren't yeah. they? You know, it's it's a, sh it's a shame, really. But I mean, obviously, we don't know what goes on behind. But when you get a band like them, so much talent in split in different ways, mm. you know, and they've gone different routes. but. They 
that you know no one will ever forget in some ways because they are only maybe together for such a short time means that they haven't produced that amount of music and it'll always be highly sought after but they're signatures and they've got a very very big cult audience oasis they really have you know it's extremely it's t it, from a fan's perspective it's sad that they're not performing together yeah but uh, anyone with that talent it's always you want to see them out there on the stage performing but Liam Gallagher, you know, hand signed by the man himself. Remember all these hand signed signatures. We, when we say hand signed, we guarantee that he's held that in his hand and personally signed it. It's not printed, not facsimile. It's not a, an altar pen. We guarantee that he's hand signed. And these hand signed items that are in the show will come with a separate certificate of authenticity that with an Aftal backing, which means you've got all the official backing of Aftal, which is one of the top trade organizations in the world and you know that that is 100% real keep the certificate keep everything that lock it away keep it safe because come the day you may want to move that on or give it to someone if you've got that certificate and that paperwork it will definitely add to the value yeah Liam Gallagher framed uh, six CD personally signed photo uh, is yours snap it up swiftly though uh, as you said 279 pounds 99 um, and you can go on the clear page way as well 70 pounds today is your first payment of four if you want to grab that one final two items and um again uh love lady gaga um obviously how long has she been around her maybe a 10 12 years something like that yeah um, probably yeah. And great singer and like you said um, branched into movies as well now yeah she's a talented actress you know she's um yeah, I, she, I she imagine she's fun to go out with. I wouldn't mind going out on the Raz with her, you know. I can imagine. <laughs> if you're I'm surprised she, you haven't. All no, of your, no. you know, your, your, your names that you know. <laughs> Lady Gaga, if you're out there, give us a buzz, babe. <laughs> I'll show you around. We'll have a night of fun, you know. <laughs> I mean, out on the town. Of course, of course. To be, you know, take you out, a few beers or whatever. Yeah. A few glasses of wine, be lovely to me. But no, I think she's fantastic. You yeah. Know? She's great music. She's a great actress. And again, that is very now, you know, Lady Gaga. Gaga proven very popular. Imagine well, millions of fans around the world would love to get their hands on that. Remember, if you get any of these, you're one of only a hundred people in the world. If you have joined, by the way, during these during the hour, if you look at the website and you wonder why some of the others are in a different price point, it's because they're smaller. They're limited edition of 50, but they are much smaller and they're not unique to this channel as these are. So that's why they're different. These are much bigger. So that's the reason why. Uh, it's Lady Gaga, and that's the fame. A framed platinum disc and photo display, uh, two hundred and forty-nine ninety-nine. Um, but again, if you want to sp uh, split the cost or spread the cost, Clearpay is available for you on the website collectiblesguru.com. Um, or if you want to buy it on the phones, you can free phone 0800 254 5402. Uh, and final item, we've kind of come full circle because we started with uh, with David Bowie, and we're going to finish with the man himself. Uh, but this, the first one was Aladdin Sane. This one is um, is Heroes, isn't it? Yeah, this is so limited. This has proven a massive seller in the Bowie run and we've got quite a few different Bowie ones. This has been the biggest seller. I love the, the art there, that you've got the, re, the uh, reproduction, the art print of him from the original painting, which is a great, great image. Again, it's, a, it's almost about eight by 10, that in real life, that image get just alone of him, mm. of the painting. Then you've got the image from the disc itself of Heroes, the CD disc. Then you've got the gold disc in the middle. But this one is stunning. And I think, because it's so different, it looks great. I mean, that could sit with four oil paintings. Oh, it? yeah. It's so different, you know. And I mean, if you're lucky enough to have some of the or you're into pop art and things like that, this really does turn heads. But again, we're down to the last few of them. It's single figures. So if you're lucky enough to get one, don't hang around. If you want one of them, I think, you know, not we had 100 originally yeah. in other places. Now we've got less than single figures. Once they're gone, that's it. So don't miss out on that one. Be quick. Yeah, and it shows the pop popularity of, of, of Bowie and like again we talked about him earlier on how he kind of almost like reinvented himself through all the different eras didn't he yeah he was amazing really I mean he to say touched the heart of people with his obviously his music constantly reinvented himself he hit them with you know his fashion possibly sexuality all the different things he is an actor he was an immense talent but he hit 
lots of people of lots of ages and genres could see something in him that greatly inspired him but his music was so diverse as well in mm. my opinion you know he some of his music he does that's that rocky like let's dance you know and there is something like you know Starman or something a bit weird like the uh, the gnome song oh the you gnome know. song yeah 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 and that space space oddity as yeah, well yeah space did, oddity he? the first one that really put him on yeah. the map but his his music was diverse but he was so talented and a travesty again that he's no longer here but a massive massive database of fans worldwide of David Bowie if you want one of those don't even think about delaying because you've literally got less than a one in ten chance to get in one and once it's gone you won't see it no more yeah and it shows you the popularity like you said that so many have gone already if this is of any interest snap it up on the website right now the item number is 351214 uh, for the heroes uh, framed platinum disc and photo display 62 pounds 50 if you want to use clear pay that would be your first clear pay payment of four uh, I'm almost out of time, but just before we go, worth having a quick little uh, look at the website because obviously we've focused on music today, but there's yeah. lots more on the website, isn't there? Well, obviously there's loads of sport, as you expect here on Sporty Stuff TV, but we've got all these great music items as well. We have a bit of TV film, there's some heritage. A lot of the items are signed images from actually from stars. We also have a great selection of different discs. Obviously we can't all put them in one show. So there's Eric Clapton, there's Kylie there, you know, Diana Ross, you know, Sting, Bee Gees, got Robbie Williams. You've got a real good mix on there. And one or two really rare vinyl records as well, limited edition actual records. So really, really great eyes. But keep watching, keep looking, you'll love them. Gaza, thanks so much. Yeah, and you, mate. Good to see you. Uh, we'll see you again very soon on the Collectibles Guru on Sporty Stuff Bye. TV. <laughs>